hockey season is over, which sucks. Fortunately, uh, we have baseball here in America, which is the greatest game ever made. Hockey's a close second, though. Well done, Canada. So I've decided that today, we're going to play ice hockey for the NES. And I know there are a lot of people out there who are Blades of Steel people. Uh, I've always been an ice hockey guy. I think this is the most fun hockey game on the NES. Uh, and uh, it's especially great multiplayer game, even to this day. So uh, I just want to revisit it and cheer myself up. I'm sure I'll lose at this, too. That's sort of the recurring theme here. Derek loses at everything. All right, let's choose our team here. We got six teams to choose from. Of course, there's USA, Sweden, Poland, Canada, Russia, and TCH. I, what is T... I'm, I don't know what TCH is. I don't know what country... I don't know... I don't know where that is. But I guess since, I mean, this review can't get any more American than it is right now, we might as well just go with Team USA. Now, who are we going to play? Uh, you know what, we're going to pick the Swedes. Partially because, you know, I'm not a coward. Also because, man, Swedish women are so pretty. They're so, they're beautiful. All right, now we have to assemble our team. And this is where ice hockey gets interesting because there are three, if you've never played this game, there are three different players, three different player varieties to choose from. You've got sort of skinny guy who's really fast, uh, then you've got middle guy who's in the middle, and then you've got fat guy. And they, they all have different, uh, you know, attributes. Fat guy's really slow, but he's hard to knock off the puck, and he has a hell of a slap shot. You know, medium guy's in the middle, skinny guy's really fast, and he can move with the puck, uh, but his shot's kind of weak, so... You know, there are pluses and minuses, and I think that's one of the interesting things about ice hockey, especially when you play with friends, is this part of it, like, knowing how your friend plays and constructing a team that would efficiently combat his play style, you know? And it's all about matchups, really. Just like real hockey. And of course, what I like to do is I like to have two big fat guys on my blue line uh, just unleash, just unload the slappers from the blue line. And then I like to have two medium guys moving the puck and setting up plays. All right, here we go, period one. I don't see any Swedish women. I just see a bunch of Swedish hockey players that are about to rue the f***ing day. They're gonna rue the day. All right, here we go. The puck is dropped. Oh, my goalie, already making saves. Already making saves. All right, one nothing Sweden, no big deal. We're gonna get that one right back. Need my D crash in the net. There we go. Here we go. What a play. Beautiful. See, that's what you get those odd man breaks. You gotta bury it. I learned that from Mario Lemieux. He always buried it. Now, if you've never played ice hockey, um, you also control your goalie. So, um, in addition to controlling one player on the ice at a time, you also have to move your goalie around. Oh, I picked off my pass. Which can get a little confusing, and you know, it, ta it does take a little bit of time to get used to that. Damn it! 2 nothing, 2-1 to one, Sweden. We broke the tie. I'm about to break their back. Drop my controller. Oh, skinny guy knocked me off the puck. You skinny guy. You know, the shame of it is Sweden is really one of my favorite countries. Um, it's 5-1. Five, five, like, I can't even get, I can't even get the puck in their end. This is humiliating. Like, I don't, I don't mind losing to a human. But, like, losing to an inanimate object, this is just embarrassing. marches up the ice and buries it. I feel real weird about my chances now. You know, I'm playing this single player right now because no one wants to play with me. Not that I can blame them. But the point is, this is just a great multiplayer game. Scored again! That's three! Seven to three! Oh, things are getting weird. Now here come the Zambonis. Look at the Zambonis. Ah, uh, the Zamboni. You know, that was my dream job. That's all I ever wanted to do in life was drive a Zamboni. Here we go, here we go! So the pr here's here's part of the trick is you gotta you gotta stall their goalie out, you know? Oh 8-3. God damn it! 
you know what that means. All that means is that when I come back and win this, that a statue will be erected and bejeweled in my name. Icing. Who ices the puck in ice hockey for the NES? Get real, Sweden. Is there some kind of cheat code that, like, am I missing something here? This is ridiculous. I, oh, that was, like, in the crease. It was almost in the net, and he made that save. There we go. At least we get some dignity. It's 12 to 4. And then they skate around and celebrate. You know what? I'd like to go out there and slash each and every one of them. Right in the back of the knee. Alright, we're gonna try one more game. And if we're gonna do it, we might as well do it right. We might as well try Team TCH. I mean, let's just do it, right? They wear, like... They're the only team in the game that wears a white, grayish jersey. So let's... Maybe they're good. I don't know. Oh, they dropped the puck! I wasn't paying attention and they scored! The Russians scored from center ice! Come on, Team TCH! Oh, bounced off my goalie and into the net! 2 nothing Russia! Putin! Alright, Team TCH. If there's one thing we can't do, it's we can't lose our composure. We gotta keep our composure! Just keep it together! We didn't do a montage before this. Had we done a, a montage training video, the Russians wouldn't know what hit him. Now it's 4 nothing. Good save by my goalie. Coming up big. Coming up real big. Another big save. Another big save. Another one. Can't save eight shots in a row. At some point, your D's gotta stand up. Stop being such pussies in the face of Russian oppression. I mean, like I I don't mind losing to a friend, you know, because at least then it's fun. But now, like, I'm losing to the computer. This is just pathetic. And I'm getting dominated. Like, it's not even... It's not even close. The Russians have me so frustrated and so distracted by their beautiful women that now I'm, I'm not even on my game anymore. Now I'm playing their game. And theirs is a game of fear and intimidation. I'm not even entertained by the Zambonis this time. That's how depressed I am over this, this ridiculous... This is, a, this is a avalanche of bullshit that I'm being buried beneath. Thanks, Ru thanks, Putin. Oh, missed the net. He's open. Got it. We finally got a goal. See that? Work some offense from behind your own net. You know, confuse the goal. Well, let's watch the Russians celebrate because that's fun. Fun. Thanks, Nintendo. Thanks, Ice Hockey. Ice hockey for the NES. Don't play by yourself. Don't do anything by yourself, but especially don't... Don't play ice hockey by yourself. Actually, there are some things that are probably better by yourself. Ice hockey's not one of them.